Hello everybody and welcome back to my adventures. It's episode 3 and between episodes I actually finished the house. Well uh, not the interior but the outside's pretty good. Standing a little bit further back I think it looks pretty epic. And speaking of things that look pretty epic look at what showed up behind me. It looks to be some sort of pedestal or podium for, for something. Hmm I wonder what it could be. That's right it's the entrance to an area of building, but uh, not starting on it now. This is just this is just the beginning, okay? Picture this: this mountain and this this land bit, Greco-Roman architecture, the whole way through. Maybe even Hellenistic. I think that's what it's actually called. I'm I'm not sure, but you know the stuff. You know the pillars, the fancy fancy pillars. But all of that is a bit later down the line. I think that I want to make building a core component of this series because, you know, last time I kind of focused a lot on technical projects and speedrunning the game and it kind of ruined it, so I think I'll just start building and enjoy myself. What's this guy? Oh my gosh, he just scared me. This guy is throwing bombs everywhere in Minecraft. Okay, um, seems very dangerous, you know, he's... He could have hurt my llama. You know, that that's what you that's what happens when you throw bombs near my llama. Don't worry. I won't put you in a river. Okay, okay. Oh. Oh yeah, I put the llama down there. Uh I kind of forgot that how just how long it takes to mine obsidian without enchantments. Just it takes forever. I wish I could speed it up, and which I guess I could. I could have gotten buckets and built a portal up here, but I wasn't about to do that. Anyway, if I just got this, let's light the portal. Don't have immersive portals. The portals still look very cool with the shader on. Um, it's like you can only see the little edges of it. It's like reaching in. It's really cool. Anyway, I think we should go in. Wait, 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 wait. I forgot my food. Ooh, another distraction. We got a goblin trader who has... I guess these are technically trades. You know, I got some flint for flint and steel. Oh, that this would have been an amazing trade when I was building that roof. There is stacks upon stacks of clay blocks in this roof. It took way too many resources. Okay, I got some gold, and I got a little bit more iron, and then I think that's all the stuff that I got to sell. I get very easily distracted, can't you tell? Anyway, going in. Uh, let's hope this is a pretty decent spawn. And it didn't crash. And... Oh, I hate this biome. I hate this biome for that reason. I just popped back into the overworld for a second and I noticed that it is day 101. Between last clip and two clips ago, I've had a rough time, okay? Let me tell you. Windows was like, yeah, no, you don't actually have a mic connection. You know, your headphones that go through the exact same wire, those work. But your headphones, I mean your microphone, no, those don't work. I don't know why, but they just don't. And so I went through this very long process of trying to restart in certain ways to get it back to work. And it turns out, in the end, the only thing I needed to do was just take out the um, wire and blow in the socket so it actually worked. Like, this is some ancient video game techniques, and they're finally coming into use in the modern day. I mean, like, really, I was prepared to bring out my backup mics. And then I just try that for the fun of it. And it just works somehow. I don't know how. It's magic. Okay, let's see if I can... Oh, I just clutched that. Yeah, let's go. Okay, I don't have any gold armor. Should I? Yep, I probably should. I'm gonna go get that. With all of that said, I really hope that, you know, there's not too big of a difference in audio. I don't think anything should have changed, but you never know. Okay, let's see if... These piglins want to do a little bit of trading. Let's see. Huh? Want to trade? Want to do some trading? Hmm, what do you have? Oh, hi there, zombie. Oh, let's see again. Kind of useless to me, but... Let's see again. What you have to offer? Ooh, even more useless. A fire charge. Let's see what you got this time. Wait, do you have a backpack? Okay, no, that's not a, that's not a backpack I can get. What do you got, man? <gasps> Soul Speed 3! That's perfect. Okay, do these drop quartz? I gotta know. Yes, they do. Okay, I don't need much quartz. I just need a little bit. This is enough. 
Oh, the hellhounds. That seems like a dangerous thing. Do I have any arrows? Do not have any arrows. Okay, this is not the greatest. Not the greatest, I would say. Yeah, there's a wither skeleton. Okay, you know, I was going to say, you know, before my audio quit out, that at least I don't have a wither skeleton biome. You know, because those exist. Well, it seems like I do have one of those. But, you know, I, I got two quirks. You know, I can live with it. Oh, it's all the way up there. <laughs> I just sniped him. Oh, my gosh. I kind of feel bad. I, I feel like everything here is wanting to kill me. Thank goodness the feeling is mutual. That's lava. I don't know if I can get a grave back from lava. But I don't want to find out. I feel like I've already overstayed my welcome. We're going back. Okay, yeah, I forgot that time passes in the overworld, but I'm sure it's fine. You know, I haven't experienced night almost at all. So I don't even know if it's that difficult. Okay, somehow I only have 12 quartz. I thought this stuff gave more than one even without fortune. I really want to automate carrots more. Thankfully, I have a sugarcane farm. And you might be saying, that's the wrong crop. No, no, no. Introducing... Sandpaper. Yeah, that's right. Sandpaper. Next, I need a little bit of redstone. Okay, I'm not exactly sure how this works, but I think I'm supposed to be making a kiln. Okay, now we see if this works. It doesn't have to be that big. Okay, I'm, I'm shortening this by a lot. I wasted a lot of time getting a bunch of clay. Okay, I think this is how you make breads. Okay, it looks like it is working. Oh yeah, by the way, this is the alloy kiln. I made it because I didn't want to go find a fortress. And I have two bricks. Put that there. And press. And press. And we have fresh sheet. Okay, all I need is a little bit of kelp, but there is a giant whale. So, uh, I don't know if it's going to be happy about me stealing its kelp. I think if I combine this... With a little bit of this, I do get this. And I need another one, actually. Actually, create gives you a pair of things if you need a pair, but I guess not this. Just a bit of redesigning. Let's see it in action. Not yet, though. Still gotta, still gotta do this. Oh, and there we go. It goes together, it goes apart, and... Nothing's in here. Okay. There we go. Will it work? It works. Okay, I think I'm going to keep it simple when it comes to the storage system. And just put a hopper right here. You know, no fancy create stuff yet. I'm not I'm not that loaded on andesite alloys yet. So I think, functionally, this little carrot farm is done. When I was doing a little bit of enchantment stuff, and then this guy just wandered into my house. Of course, I'm doing the only logical thing. Lucas. Okay, I don't know if I can tame him, so I'm just going to put him on a lead right here. I don't even know what he wants, but she's so cute. Welcome to the family. I of enchanting, let's do something. Okay, so we got this. I don't have enough levels for this, but I do have enough levels for this. It's called growth. I have no idea what it does, but let's see growth. Okay, yeah, I still have no idea what it does. Do I get, like, a health boost? What does growth even do? Or I forget, I should probably do some armor enchantments. Ooh! Beast burst, frenzied one, and projectile protection. Those look pretty cool. Ooh, speed. Okay, I might, I might have to save up to 30 levels to see what this is all about. And on the Highland Chestplate, we have Reckless 3, Unbreaking 2, and Protection. Okay, I'm just going to be building a mechanical crafter so I can craft something very special. No idea what this status effect is, but I just got it. And yeah, I have, I have no idea what Serenity is for. Of course, this setup is temporary. I'll probably move it into my house, but I don't have enough room right now. And this there. And it's not going to craft because we need power. And hopefully I can supply that with this. Oh. Oh, don't tell me I actually have to get a water wheel out. 
Okay, please work. Nope, it's... I gotta go the other way. Oh my gosh, it started working. Watch, watch. Oh, science. Look at all this science. I've seen this animation so many times, and yet it is so cool. I love auto-crafting. And then, we get... We get... Come on, why can't I grab? We get... No. Oh. We get... Crushing wheels! Now, because this was such a pain to get set up this episode, I'm gonna save these for the next one. And with that being said, I think I'm gonna have to wrap it up for today. It's been fun, we've done a lot, we got enchanted, and we did a little bit of crafting, and of course, we went to the nether. Um, so I'll see you next time. Bye bye